Hey, it's Matt from Practice Perfect. Welcome back to the Accelerated Learning Center. Today we're going to talk about how to create providers. Let's get started. Let's define a provider. A provider is any clinician that will be seeing a patient in your clinic. Step 1. To begin, select Housekeeping, Contacts, and then Providers from the menu bar at the top of your screen. Doing so brings you to a full list of your providers. Step 2. To add a provider, press the green plus sign. This brings you to the provider's profile where you can input all of the relevant information about the provider. Note the three tabs comprising the provider's profile. Provider, billing numbers, compensation, but today we're only going to worry about the provider in the compensation tabs. You can access a provider's profile at any time by double-clicking their name on the list. Step 3. Now this is the part where you're able to begin fleshing out your provider's profile. The minimum information required is their first name, last name, credentials, job title, and their license number. The rest is just for reference. If you cannot bill insurance companies using this provider, make sure to check the Cannot Bill Using This Provider checkbox. Finally, the Signature section allows you to add a provider signature to the system. This is a handy feature to have when providers are required to sign clinical documentation. By uploading a signature to Practice Perfect, you're able to eliminate the need for them to sign it by hand. To upload a signature, press the green plus sign below the heading and locate the image file on your computer's hard drive. Step 4. Now we're going to take a look at the Compensation tab. This list is associated with your list of fee codes. Use this tab to track and report on compensation for your providers who are paid on a revenue or receipt sharing basis. Use these headings here to designate the compensation criteria per relevant treatment, whether it be hourly, per visit, per quantity, a fixed rate, a unit, or a percentage. Then, double-click the box in the rate column. This is where you're able to set the dollar or percentage amount of compensation your providers will be receiving for the designated treatment. Disregard the expense GL as this is an optional piece of information that rarely comes into play. And lastly, if the compensation that the provider will be receiving is the same across the board regardless of the treatment, like say for example they receive 50% of the earnings on all treatments, you can highlight a fee code and select copy from current fee to all at the bottom of the screen. Thanks for visiting. Be sure to check out the other accelerated learning videos at practiceperfectemr.com. Bye for now.